Hi everyone, welcome back. I hope y'all are doing great. I'm doing okay. Welcome back to my monthly house mouse stamp project. Uh, this, I just want to come on before I create the card. This is called uh, Desert Dive and you can see um, Monica and Matt Mud Pie, of course. This is Monica and this is Mud Pie, even though I don't see a little niche. Monica's smaller. Anyway, what I came on to discuss with you last month, I think I talked to you about it. Um, it's how they changed the packaging, but you see right here, it has a double, a double little layer. So, you know, this is how I got the stamp. I don't remember where I purchased it from. I don't think I got this in a D stash. I'm sure I purchased it online, but you see, this is the top portion. So the stamps that we recently, a lot of people recently got from Tuesday morning are on the white border and they don't have this little plastic. So if you have something like this and you try to pull this plastic off, you're going to ruin your stamp because this is the clean, the clean. Okay. So I just basically want to share that with you. If you have the ones on the green backing, be careful because the stamps are not intended to, this plastic is the clean. And I think maybe that's why they changed it a little bit because they were trying to, um, Get rid of the confusion that some of the crafters may have had when they were purchasing these. I know a few people had said that they had issues with it sticking. So all you have to do is just apply some pressure down like you would normally do on your whatever you use to help you stamp this image out. If you do it by hand, good for you. Um, these stamps are too big to stamp out, you know, just with your a hand thing. So that is all I want to share. I'll come back and share with the completing project. All right, so I stamped and colored everything up. I want to talk to you real quick about this stamp. Uh, if you have it, let me know. So you see right here, right there, when you stamp it out, it looks like flames are coming up and it has a duck or some birds and some flowers. So I am under the impression that this is like a tablecloth on the table and they're eating the ice cream because the car kind of cuts off. You notice when you stamp it off, it um, is the a direct delineation. I I am under the impression that that stamp is a larger picture that they've just chosen to cut and use that. I'm going to use this Life Sweep from um, Fiskers and put the sentiment right there. You know, normally for some of the house mouse stamps, I'm like, I don't have a sentiment for it. But I've been really, really working hard on trying to do sentiments as well as... Um, dressing the inside but today the inside is going to be naked so um that's okay life sweet and i like the red rubber that was my first time using this one i believe this particular stamp and you see you didn't have to stamp on stamp off stamp on stamp off um which is cool now if it had been a clear one i probably would have tested it out first just because i'm learning <laughs> i'm learning to not complain about that there we go I hope you all are doing okay. So now, I'll put this to the side. I have this embossing um, folder, and I like it because it has flowers on there. And it actually has a place for the sentiment, but I am going to turn it this way, and I think I want to use some of this. Oh, this is a short roll of ribbon. I didn't know it was that short, but we're going to make it work. going to make it work. So, um, you know, I don't normally do like layers and stuff like that. So I'm just trying my best to, uh, think outside the box, the embossing portion. I really, really like this embossing folder. And I was like, I don't want to mess up my embossing folder sheet, you know, the sheet with, um, doing this, but <laughs> it's like, you can always emboss more. And I thought it would look really well, the color and the little texture, because there's flowers underneath and um, it's flowers on that tablecloth. This one I cut a little bit too short, um, but that's okay. And so you're only going to see like this much, but you know, it's a little bit too short. So this is the finished card. Nothing on the inside. Just blank. Life sweet. Life sweet. And I chose to color the Contain it the exact same color. If you eat, well, most of the um, ice cream companies have the same like container, and then their the flavor may be different. So one is blueberry because it says berry blessing, and one is strawberry or whatever pink 
you want to put in there that's a berry uh cherry will be a little bit darker but that is that i hope that you enjoyed and until next time happy crafting